Another question is about are there a lot of Muslims in Jamaica today and are they received well? Um, there are a number of Muslims in Jamaica. If, if, if you know Jamaica itself, there's in Spanish Town and um, there is in Black River and in Clarendon and Kingston. In Kingston there's, there's a big mosque in Kingston and now uh, Montego Bay they have land and they're in Port Maria area on the north coast. Uh, they're Muslims. I lived in Jamaica for four years, so there's, there's a number of Muslims there. and It's one of the places where a lot of people are accepting Islam. But the problem there, there's an, ec there's a <coughs> there's an economic problem. So unless you have employment or some way for people to you know, deal with their life economically, it's hard to really practice a way of life that's very different from society, unless you've got an economic base. And I think that's the problem the Muslims have today, is a practical way where people can accept Islam and they can really change their life completely. That's the problem. It's not a problem of people listening to Islam, and especially in Jamaica because of the Rastafarian movement and Marcus Gavi. There's a consciousness in terms of, uh, of, of African culture and you know, Middle Eastern culture that people are open-minded like uh, there. So people, there, are, there are a number of people. Jimmy Cliff, if you don't even know Jamaican culture, Jimmy Cliff, he's a Muslim. His name is Naeem Bashir, is his name, Jimmy Cliff. Okay, anybody else have a question?